Prepare yourself, Richards. You face the might of doom. I don't know who you are, friend, but it's high time you leave. Yeah, you best make like a banana before I split you in two. Ah, Grim. It seems the years have never dulled your level of tact towards me. I'd punish you for such transgressions, but it seems that fate and Richards has done so already. Ah, you son of- Wait. Hold on. I know you. Ah, yes, Richards. The so-called smartest man alive. Gazes upon the man you ruined so long ago. How could I have been so blind? It was staring me right in the face. Yes, Richards. It is I. Gaze upon your nemesis, Victor Va- Dr. Octavius. What? From MIT, right? No, imbecile. I'm- Wait, wait, wait. I got it. You're Iron Man. Iron Man? Iron Man? What will possess you to think that I am him? Mm, uh, no reason. Fools! I am no mere charlatan in playing dress-up. I am not your so-called villain of the week. For I am Victor Von Doom. Yes, Richards, that Von Doom. Witness the fruits of my labor as I make you beg for mercy. Yeah, I'm drawing a blanket. Are you serious right now? Okay. You sure you're not Iron Man? Because you got the rocket boots, the tech, the inflated eagle. In silence, child! Think back, imbecile, to the dawn of our studies at university. Uh, Ben, help me out here. Victor, Victor. Oh, yeah, that exchange student from uh, Romania? Liberia, whatever. Oh, yeah. Victor. <sighs> Finally, you remember the accumulation I faced by your hand. Victor, you're the reason our dorm house blew up that day. So many people had to move away because you thought it'd be a good idea to open a portal to hell where we sleep, all because of your weird mommy issues. W wait, what? Don't ask it. Lies. I know you schemed Richards. You want to further your own ego. You tap with my nose because you couldn't comprehend that Doom's mind is no equal. You add further insults to Doom, but rob me both my face and the hand of Sue Storm. Where is Sue, anyway? Shut up, Johnny. Victor, I told you specifically, your notes had faults in them, and surprise, surprise, it quite literally blew up in your face. Doom makes no mistakes to the church. If that's the case, why do you wear the mask? And, if you're so much smarter than me, how come you haven't fixed your face yet? Silence. None may gaze upon the face of doom. Come on, man, be honest. You wear it because it looks cool, don't you? Enough! I did not come here to play platitudes, you fantastic fools. While you toil away in the limelight, I became revered among my countrymen. I fought as armor with the monks of Tibet, trained with misses that rival the sorcerer supreme. Liberating my nation from oppression where my word is law. What have you done, Richards? What can you attest to? Well, I've done some interplanetary space travel, bought a giant monster in there, time travel, and we've occasionally dabbled in the multiverse. Ha! <laughs> Mere child's play for the likes of Doom. I also sleep in a big bed with my wife. Curse you, Richards! Are we sure he isn't Iron Man? Shut up, Steve Rogers.